God, the hell it does to get this company. Would you sit down and be quiet? What did you know about this? Just what I told you yesterday. You sold your shares to an offshore corporation that Dusty happens to own. Did my father give him enough? I don't think this was about money. Really? What's it about? You want the truth? No, I want you to lie to me. Okay, from what I understand, this wasn't about Dusty gaining a company. This was more about... More about what? Getting you out of it. This was a setup from the beginning, wasn't it? What are you talking about? Meg was the one who encouraged me to sell my shares. She said it would be easier for us. Well, maybe she and was right And then all of a sudden, as if by magic, Dusty turns out to be the buyer. Hold on. You think Dusty and Meg were in on this Well, together? it wouldn't be the first time that Dusty used my wife as a tool to try and get to me. No. You're wrong. You're wrong. That's I am sick happened. of Dusty interfering with my life. I'm not going to sit here and take it anymore. Well, you've already lost worldwide. What can you do now? I can make sure that he never does anything like this ever again. You want Dusty to stop interfering? Then keep your wife occupied and get her as far away from Dusty as humanly possible. Then what else do you think I intend to do? I don't know. Something a lot worse. Don't worry. You won't be implicated. Okay. You don't own the company anymore. You've got nothing tying you down. So take your pretty little wife and move somewhere else. Start a new life somewhere else. That whole out of sight, out of mind thing usually works pretty well. No, no. No more running away. That won't work this time. So what will? Paul, answer me. What are you going to do, Dusty? I'm not leaving until you tell me what's in store for Dusty. Okay. Look, you don't need to worry you pretty little head about it. Excuse me, you cannot threaten him like that and expect me just okay, to forget you about stay it. Stay out of it, okay? I'll take care of him. I don't need your help. You'll take you'll take care of him? What is that supposed to mean? I gotta go. Paul. Paul. I go. Paul, get back here. Paul! I have a job for you. I'm not interested. Really? Because I pay a lot better than the old man did. Since when do you have money? You don't think the old man would leave me an inheritance? How much are we talking about? Enough. Hey, never mind. I'll go give money to somebody who likes money. And what is it that you want me to do? I want you to set something on Who? Dusty Donovan. The guy your father was holding? Yeah. All you have to do is plant some drugs on him and the police will take care of the rest. The drugs? What makes you think I can make a score like that? You used to work for James, right? Don't you have connections? And what makes you think I want to use them to help you? Because you owe me. You owe me. You kidnapped my wife and my unborn baby. Have you forgotten that? No, I have not. And I didn't press charges. Well, maybe that would change. Okay. Okay. I'll see what I can do. Right. You do that. You see what you can do. You call him off. You call him off right now or I tell Dusty everything. You're not going to tell Dusty anything. Oh, you want to bet? Yeah. Speed dial number three. Really? Am I one or two? <laughs> Come on. You're not going to tell Dusty anything. Because if you do, you'll have to admit to him that you went behind his back. Why? I'll tell him the truth, that I overheard a conversation. I had absolutely nothing to do with it. Really? What if I tell him otherwise? You wouldn't dare. No? No. If Meg found out how paranoid you are about the two of hey, them... Meg is never going to leave me. Can you honestly say the same to me about you and Dusty? You send Dusty to prison for drug possession. He's going to leave me anyway. Come on, look, I got he's got to enough lose. money now. He can get himself out of trouble. It's not like he's going to go to jail. Well, then why do this? Because it's part of a larger plan. Oh, you have, a, you have a plan? Yes. It's in stages. I have to discredit him in stages. First, I start with the drugs, and then the next thing you know, Meg knows he's not such a great big <laughs> oh, hero. What? What is so funny? You, you really think having him arrested is going to do that? Well, it's possession. It's not like it's, it's, it's a big charge. So? You, you've been arrested how many times? For a lot worse. <laughs> and somehow Meg still thinks you hung the freaking mouth. Oh, it'll be different with Dusty. <laughs> okay. You keep telling yourself that. Hey. This will work, Emily, because this has to work. Go off my arm. You're a lot crazier than I ever thought. You're not doing 
doing this. I'm not helping you do this. I should have stayed away. You know what? You're just bitter because all of a sudden Dusty is chasing Meg. Apparently the nostalgic luster of Emily has worn off. It's vicious. All you have to do is keep your mouth shut, okay? And then play the role of the concerned girlfriend while they cart him away in handcuffs. That's all. I don't know. It could get awfully crowded, you know, if your wife decides to show up. What is that supposed Meg, to Meg, when she finds out that Dusty was arrested and carted hey. off to prison. No, shut up. Crying her eyes out to get justice of it all. Don't talk to her like that. You understand me? Okay, I'm going to tell him. You want me to tell him? Fine. Let's hear it. The reason Paul's so annoyed with me, I told him the truth. I told him he needs professional help. Well, that goes without saying. Well, apparently he struck a nerve. Oh, come on, look, I get what you have to say. Oh, don't you? No, not the least. You gotta learn how to talk to a lady. Oh, okay, next time I'm around when I'll practice. Is he harassing you? No, he considers a conversation, but don't worry, I can handle him. You sure? Mm -hmm. Hey, Dusty, do you have saddle sores and ride around on your white horse? Okay, all day? you know what? Ignore him. Were you going somewhere? Yeah, I was going back to the lake for you. Would you like some company? Yeah, I'd love some. gonna sit there and let your wife walk out on you and take your child with her. I don't know, what do you want me to do? Go after her. To say what? She doesn't want to hear anything I have to say. She's gonna go straight to Donald. Come on. Don't start with me. Not 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 now. Just all little boys sit around and cry. Real men do something, they take action. Like what? Like what? What? If something's in the way of what you want, get rid of it for good. You're right. What? I said you're right. I know exactly what to do.